Well, Judy, the various city departments are getting calls about having no heat and wellness calls. These are all being fielded by these city departments uh, through the coordination of the Office of Emergency Management and Communication, otherwise known as OEMC. Now, this has all been triggered because of those weather advisories that keep coming in, either about the wind chills or about the snow. Now, while many in Chicago are still struggling to deal with this very, very cold weather, the city and city officials are reminding folks that the cold can be dangerous. Chicago's deep freeze may be coming to an end, but the area's Arctic temperatures aren't warming up fast enough for some like Suzanne, who recently moved here from Amsterdam. I, mean, I was hoping for a less cold. Um, I have a little dog and he's wearing a jacket and boots. Sub-zero temperatures began to climb a bit into the double digits today, but it was still just plain miserable for some city dwellers and tourists alike. Thailand, is, there's only one winter, it's hot. Hot weather here. And while many did their level best to embrace the cold, city officials continue to warn about the dangers of winter weather. So far, the Cook County Medical Examiner's Office has recorded eight cold-related deaths since November, with four of those occurring in the last five days. As of this morning, more than 1,000 calls have been made to 311 about the winter weather since January 12th to this morning. There have been 844 calls about no heat, 247 requests for senior well-being checks, and 70 inquiries about the city's warming centers. The city of Chicago has extended its emergency operations weather plan because of the threat of more extreme cold and snow. We've decided to extend it because we know on Friday it's likely to get cold again. We might hit another advisory. Uh, so we're going to maintain those warming centers. We're going to maintain our well-being checks. Uh, right now it's looking like through Monday morning perhaps. And while forecasters predict another blast of snow and cold on the way, efforts to brave this Chicago winter are far from over. I cannot wait. I'm from New Mexico, so like I want like that dry desert heat, please. That sounds really, really good right about now. We also got a call from a spokesperson for the uh, buildings department that says that so far they've received roughly 1,300 complaints about no heat in apartment buildings, and of course they're dealing with that. City of Chicago saying make sure that if you have a problem, you call 311. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.